All right, everyone, this is Duranis coming to you again with a demonstration of the new 3D demo for the game Dead Frontier. I've already downloaded the Unity browser, so this should go quick. All right, as you can see here, the game is in full 3D with the perspective being from the top slightly tilted towards the bottom. And you can see the character here is currently wielding what appears to be a fire axe, a backpack, some kind of helmet, and a trench coat. Now the movement and controls seem to remain the same, i.e. you use the mouse to look around, you can sometimes see my mouse flickering in and out, that's because there is no targeting reticle created yet, as far as I can tell. And the movement controls are still the same, you move, use the WASD keys to move around on the ground. Now I'm poking around, I'm assuming the loot will remain the same. Here's a car that appears to be on fire. There is a fire animation, however if you'll notice there is no shadow of the flames, just the outline of the car. But the car does, flaming car does illuminate its surroundings, as you'd expect. Now here I am cruising around a building. The one annoying part I encountered is that there's no way to change from which perspective it's tilted, which means if you want to do like I'm doing right now and go behind a building, you're not going to be able to see what you're doing, which appears to be a bit of an oversight from what I can see. I'm hoping admin is going to change it so that you can see through transparent buildings like they'll become transparent when you're on the other side. I'm still cruising around. I'm using the shift key. It does appear to uh, change your running speed, so I'm guessing the sh sprint functionality is already programmed in. Of course, that could be psychosomatic on my part. I'm looking around. Uh, you'll see just like if you were in, um, in high quality in the inner city, you'll see there is a flashlight. It does appear to be somewhat wider than in the original 2D version, which is kind of helpful. Yeah, I'm moving around, just checking out. There are no zombies, you'll notice. Um, from what I've seen on the development blog as of now, admin has not created the animations or the images for the zombies yet. And I tried clicking a couple of times, but other than shift hands on the axe when he's moving around, this little guy doesn't appear to be doing anything with it. You can't swing it yet, so attack animations have not been included. However, the very fact that he's holding what appears to be a wood axe indicates that, like Admin promised, you will be able to see individual weapon images. And I'm just running around little circles around there. Now, it was really high quality. You're seeing it as somewhat poor quality, mostly because of the video uploading process, but also because I have the zoom feature set up pretty high. But when you're at about normal zoom in, you will be able to see it properly. It's actually pretty decent. Anyway, that concludes 